Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I'm going to be giving you guys the ultimate room tour. I've been wanting to do this room tour for the longest of time. So finally, I'm going to be doing this room tour for you guys. So if you're new to this channel, guys, please like, subscribe, and comment. Subscribing is free, liking is free, and commenting is absolutely free. Make sure you comment, obviously, after you watch the video. So when you enter, this is the door, and it has a hanger here, okay? This is where I hang all my enemies, all my ops, all those people that don't like me. This is where I hang them, okay? Moving on to this side, this is where the wardrobe is. The wardrobe obviously has two sides, one this side and one this side, okay? So we're gonna open this side. This is the ghetto, okay? This is where the ghetto side is and then this is the more interesting part. So let's start with the ghetto side, then we'll go to the more interesting part. Okay, so this side obviously has two shelves. One at the top. Now from the top, make it drop. Okay, I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking, okay? So one at the top and one at the bottom. The top one has all the extra bed sheets. Some of you have not changed your bed sheets since Titanic. It's been 84 years. Change those bed sheets. Change them. And then here at the bottom we have two bags. I have one bag. This is my emergency bag, okay? This is where every single thing that's important to me stays, okay? Two important bags to me. My camera bag and this one. This one is where all my documents are, all my everything that I need as a human being. This is where it is, okay? So if you want to play with my life, play with this bag, okay? It's also good to have everything in one bag so that when shit hits the fan, Donald Trump is looking for me. I'm out. I'm running. I'm in Canada. I'm at the borders, okay? I'm in, I'm in London. Yeah? And then this is the other bag that I have. I was giving this bag at school. One day when I'm rich enough, I'll be able to do a quick trip. A quick trip to Bali, a quick trip to Vegas maybe, a quick trip to somewhere, okay? So this bag is a hopeful bag. One day I will travel somewhere very nice, okay? And then here we have this Wakanda forever. Obviously I haven't found somewhere to hang it, so it's gonna stay here for now, yeah? So just at the bottom of this ghetto side, we have the things that I don't need to use right now. So we have like my suitcases, things, suitcases that I'll never use anytime soon. And then we'll have um, my camera stuff. And then I've also my other camera lighting that my friend gave me. So I haven't yet used them. So I've, I've just put everything that I'm not using currently, I've put it on this side so that we have, we create space and we have enough room here. So that's it for this side. Then let's move on to the other side so I can show you the more interesting side, okay? Okay, so let me show you guys this side, okay? So similar to the other shelf on the other side, on the top is where I keep like all the things that I don't need to use. So things like my steamer iron, paper towels, my shoe cleaning products, like all those things that I don't really need to use right now, like the toilet paper for toilet purposes. All of those things, I keep them at the top. Like when I don't need to use them, I always just get them when I need to use them. Okay, those are like extra stuff, okay? Then we now have the bottom shelf here. So let me zoom in. Let me stand on this side so I can show you properly. Okay, so now that I've zoomed in, now that I'm up close and personal, okay? Um, this is why I keep like all my caps because you guys know I have a big big head So I always wear caps just to hide the big big head just to compress it. You understand? And then we have my t-shirts like I, I try to organize my t-shirt as much as possible so that I have an easy time just getting them and putting them back up if that makes sense And then on the other side I have like my jeans my shorts and my sweatpants if that makes sense any sense yeah, and then this side is where I keep like all the t-shirts that don't need to be folded So like I have this iconic t-shirt that you guys have seen all over Instagram If you're not following me on Instagram then like just follow me You will see that everyone has seen this t-shirt on Instagram Like I'm not even playing with you guys like I like this t-shirt so much that um, I don't know if I'm gonna stop wearing it anytime soon To be honest with you guys, I'm not, I'm not even lying Like I'm not even, I'm not even, no cap no cap. I got this t-shirt when I used to play in the NFL when life was good when people used to call me What was, what was my name? Is it Magiva? Magiva? Makiva? Listen, let's not let's not focus on the name. I used to play in the NFL, and that's all you need to know. Okay? Life was good until they kicked me out. Yeah, they kicked me out. So this is the only memory that I have, and I've lost two buttons already. But we move. Okay. So guys, I'm joking. I actually bought this T-shirt in a thrift store. It was like seven dollars. I saw it and I said, I'm taking it. I don't care if they don't have buttons. I'll make it fashion. Okay? So let me put this back. 
so i tried to organize this side of t-shirts according to the size so like the t-shirts the hoodies the jackets and then like the, the, the coats and stuff like that just to try and keep everything organized because when you're in a rush and you're trying to grab something at least you know where to find it if that makes sense at the bottom is where i keep all my shoes i keep all my shoes in boxes because they're just better when they're in boxes so this is how i've lined them up starting from my convents my vans my air force ones and my jordan ones just because they're better when they're in boxes guys just keep your shoes in boxes if you can i've lost some of the boxes for my other shoes so i keep them under my table but they're still not a bad thing so if you have the boxes keep them in boxes but if you don't have boxes just find somewhere nice to keep them if that makes sense so let's now move on to the table Hey guys, so this is the table. The table has different parts of it. So it's got like this side and then this side, the productive side and then the shower side. <laughs> the shower side, okay? So basically, this is why I do like my editing and all of that stuff. It's even got this little opening here. This is where I have like, I have this little pen and this little book where I like write down things that I'm planning to do or if I'm trying to save some money or stuff, stuff like that, okay? And then this is where I write down all my YouTube ideas and all of that stuff. That's why I'm on track with what I'm doing, if that makes sense. And then let's close this. Just on the corner, I have the glasses and the mask because this is the life that we live now. It's the mask mask world. And then we have on this side, obviously, we have the nail cutters, we have toothbrushes. I don't know why I have two of everything. Like, I feel like you need two of everything. Let's just in case one thing runs out, if that makes sense. I have like three or four toothbrushes in here. Then I have two nail cutters. Then Vaseline, just in case your lips are chopped like prison bars. And then I have the hand sanitizer, the roller thing, this thing that you roll when you have fur from dogs or from wherever you guys go. And then we have um, two deodorants, then we have two underarms, then we have the lotion that I use all the time. And then we have the, what do you call these things? The ear cleaning things, that wax that you've been keeping for the past 17 years. Clean your ears, okay? Then we also have the Nair shaving cream. Like, don't use shaving sticks. People that use shaving sticks are risky. Do you know how risky that is? I tried to use a shaving stick. I was just bleeding my life away. I'm never ever gonna use a shaving stick. I just use the shaving cream, put it under my arms. Crrr, everything is gone in 10 minutes, okay? You people that use shaving sticks are probably serial killers because that thing is... <clears throat> Even my beers, I don't shave my beers with a shaving stick. I always go to the barbers. Or when we're in lockdown, I just used to use the scissors. Just trim the top because I'm not trying to risk anything here you understand over here we have the Birkin camera bag yeah this is where I keep all my camera stuff if you want to destroy my camera life just steal this bag because this is where I keep all my camera my charger for the cameras everything for my camera is his it's a basically a camera bag okay and then just next to the table we have two washing baskets one where I keep all the dirty clothes and then this is one where I have like these are clean stuff but I just don't know where to put them so I always just fold them up and put them in here like my socks the belt the, all these extra um, sweatshirts some some shorts and t-shirts and my boxers everything is just in here all the clean stuff is in here and then over here we have the iconic window my neighbors have a black card they practice witchcraft huh? anyway so this is the iconic window so i tried to open this window and i've never been able to close it so basically everyone just watches me i'll go and shower i'll come back everyone just watching me at this point i need to start an only fan because you can't be watching me for free six dollars every month and 29 dollars for three months my promo discount sam 22 <laughs> i'm joking i'm joking i'm joking i like the fact that this window is easy access you remember that red bag that emergency bag that i showed you if shit hits the fan i'll just carry that bag out the window out that tree down i mean barbados <laughs> don't play with me i'm two steps ahead guys i'm two steps ahead okay at this point just call me tarzan because by the time i get to the tree and at the bottom you guys i'm two steps ahead i'm out of this country i'm out so let's move on so right next to this window is the chair okay this is the chair that i use to film my youtube videos and stuff like that so it's very easy it swings 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 and everything like that it's good it's good for you basically you need this chair in your life sometimes i just sit on this chair when i'm doing absolutely nothing so this is the chair that you need in your life and let's move on to the next window and this is the next window that's there so obviously this room has two windows this one is almost easy access but doesn't have a tree next to it so this one I might potentially die if I jump out of it okay so I'm not gonna use this for anything like that I'm not gonna open these blinds because if I open these blinds I don't want to have a situation where they don't close which means I have two windows that are open and they don't close at this point I have to double the price of my OnlyFans because <laughs> I'm joking guys I'm joking so the last part is the bed the bed is a queen size bed and my favorite position in bed next to the charger so I can charge my phone easily yeah thank you so much guys for watching this video make sure you look out for the behind the scenes of this video i'm gonna i'm gonna upload it right after this one or maybe a week after this one i don't know when i'm gonna upload it but thank you so much for watching make sure you like subscribe and comment down what you think of this video below make sure you guys follow me on my instagram as well and i'll be seeing you guys in my next video